Hi, this is Dinesh. Welcome to option 8. So today we are going to talk about short straddle extension adjustment. So before getting into the video, if you are not subscribed to our channel, do subscribe and click the bell icon. Now we will get into the video. I posted top 3 short straddle adjustments video long back. One of our viewers commented their queries. In that short straddle adjustments video, I explained extension adjustments. There I didn't mention when to close, which trade, all that. So he got confused about if you are taking multiple adjustments trade, then if the market is reversed, then we will get a huge loss. Right? So in this video, we will see exactly how the extension methods will work with the example. Okay. Now we can take one start straddle in June 19th, 2023 expiry. Okay. We can check the NSE website option chain where the bank nifty is trading at the at the money premium. Okay. This is NSE website option chain. I'm selecting bank nifty and choosing 19 June 2023 weekly expiry. So now currently this the other money strike price is trading 40 to 500. Here in the call side, the premium is 255 and the put side is 379. So combined premium of more or less 600 rupees. So we can take 600. Okay. Here our bank nifty at the money strike price is 40 to 500. So we are selling one lot of 40 to 500 call at the 250 rupees and one lot of 40 to 500 put 350 rupees okay with the combined premium of 600 rupees okay so now our break event is the lower side 41900 on the upper side 43100 right now we can execute our extension adjustment okay the first adjustments when you have to do is if the bank nifty touches 4300 either 4300 or 41900 either one break event is touches you have to do the your first adjustments okay when the bank nifty is touches your break even then you have to buy your break even strike price okay so you have to buy one lot your break even strike price for example it is upside so i am buying one lot of 4300 call you no need to worry that strike price is trading in which premium like it may be 150 or 200 300 whatever you no need to worry about the premiums you have to buy one lot there okay so for example i am taking 150 rupees as a premium so you are buying 4300 call at 150 rupees premium if the market is reverse then you will tend to lose this 150 right so for that what you have to do you have to sell two lot below 200 strike price which is trading half of this premium okay for example 43300 call is trading around 75 rupees means you have to sell two lot so that you can collect the 150 premium here no credit no debit right whatever you bought that you have collected here now your range is extended 41,900 to 43,300. If the bank nifty is traded in this range, you no need to worry, you will not lose your money. So now we can check one example. If the bank nifty closed at 43,200 on expiry day, okay, then how this will work? Your short straddle will be in loss of 100 points. Why? Because here we have only collected 600 rupees so our break event is 4300 only so but it closed around 43200 so we have lost 100 points here okay then we have done one adjustment trade when the bank nifty touches 4300 right so here you can see you have bought one lot of 4300 with a premium of 150 rupees right so uh, 150 minus 100 because this this strike price is 4300 but you bought it 
for 150 rupees on the expiry day your premium will be come to 100 so 150 minus 100 50 so 50 points you lost in this strike price right then you sold two lots in 43 300 call so there you have collected 150 rupees so this whole 150 rupees will go to zero right then here you have profit of 150 points so finally in short straddle you have lost 100 points in adjustment trade for this strike price you lost 50 but this strike price you have 150 points so 100 point overall 100 point is profit so finally 100 minus 100 zero rupees so no loss no profit okay you can at least come up with no loss here now you can ask one more question even after taking the adjustment trade if the bank nifty is touches 43300 then what i can do yes you can do your second adjustment trade here so when the bank nifty is touches your break even 43300 then you have to buy two lot of 43300 because you already sold two lot so you, now you are buying two lots okay so you can ask sir i sold it for only 75 rupees but now the price will be increased yes so here you are buying at 150 rupees of two lots so totally 300 rupees but you are collected only 150 rupees but you are buying at 300 rupees so you no need to worry you can collect your 300 rupees in below strike price where it is traded 75 rupees okay so so here i am taking 43500 call which is trading in 75 rupees okay there i am selling four lot okay so 75 into 4 you are collecting 300 rupees so here you bought it for 300 and here you have collected for 300 okay ideally how the logic is works once you buy the two lot here this first adjustment straddle will square off right you sold it for 150 but you bought it for 300 so ideally this will get squared off this position will remain active right here here you can see the two lots which i sold it for 150 okay but i bought it for 300 okay but i collected again 300 here ideally you can see the 150 point is still in our profit only because we ha we have collected 150 but we sold it one for 300 and again we have collected 300 in the below strike price correct so ideally we have 150 point as profit only okay now your break event is changed to 43,300 to 43,500 right so if the bank nifty is traded between this range then you will not lose your money you can come up with no loss okay so how this will work okay we can check one scenario on expiry day if the bank nifty is closest closed at 43400 then how the scenario will work okay then if it is closed 43400 your main short straddle will be in loss of 300 points correct because this short straddle break event is 4300 but it's ended with 43400 so 300 point loss here and your first adjustment trade you bought it for 150 rupees correct so if the nifty if the bank nifty is closed in 43 400 then this 150 would have come to 300 rupees totally this will come to 300 correct actually we have closed this position in 300 rupees only so here no loss no profit so zero point next adjustment trade so in this adjustment trade we sold four lot of 43 500 call correct we have collected 300 rupees that will go to zero so we have 300 rupees profit here finally 300 point loss in short straddle and 300 rupees profit in our adjustment trade so you can come out with no loss even you can ask 
one more question if the bank nifty is again it's reversed back and closed in 43200 then how it will work you can see the same scenario your short straddle will be in loss of 100 points and your adjustment trade will be in loss of 200 points but your adjustment trade will be the profit of 300 points okay so you can combine this two loss as a 300 points and this profit as a 300 points so finally here also you will come out with no loss when your bank nifty is reversing back and again closed between this 41900 to 4300 then you will get a good profit okay this is where the extension adjustment will work okay hope you get the knowledge of extension adjustment how it works thank you thank you for watching keep supporting us